Hi, I'm Dandy Reiner from Hatchfinders Fly Shop in Livingston, Montana. Right now I'm tying a caddis soft tackle, um, another wonderfully effective pattern. Uh, if you fish this trailing behind an elk hair caddis, many times it'll hit this soft tackle. Very simple, only a few ingredients involved. Let me show you. You'll want to use an emerger hook. We typically tie these um, size 12, 14, 16. You can even do a little larger, size 10 if you like. This is a yellow olive thread. You can use um, a dark olive. I'm gonna put a thread base on my hook and at hook point, I'm going to tie in my French tinsel. This is a small silver tinsel. Feel free to play around with the colors. You can do copper, gold, or a holographic, but you'll want a small or extra small tinsel. So I'm going to snip off a piece of that and tie it right onto my hook. This caddis soft tackle has a, a pretty slender body and I use super fine dubbing. Uh, I will be using a little bit of light olive, but uh, you can use pale evening done. You can play around with the color. You can mix your own, but typically a light olive or pale evening done. So I'm going to Go ahead and dub the body. And starting from the rear of the fly, I'm going to move forward, adding more dubbing as I need. Try to keep the body even with no big lumps or gaps. And you can work backwards and forwards to make sure you have a nice, smooth, even body. And the next step is uh, I wrap with my tinsel. I wrap forward, keeping your wraps even. You want them as evenly spaced as you can get. And then we'll trim off this tag end. There's our body, really simple. The, the wing is a uh, CDC. This is a medium done. Again, you can play around with the colors. Trout Hunter CDC is my favorite. You get big, beautiful feathers in the Trout Hunter packages. What I typically do is I hold it from on, on the tip and then I just simply pull back the little fibers and I tie it in at the, the tip. A few good wraps, I snip off the, the excess. And I just, with the fibers reaching back, I wrap it around quite a few times. And I just broke my, I broke it. I can tie that in again. So I take the CDC feather 
and I hold it at the tag end and I push all the fibers back and I tie it in at the tip, several good wraps, trim off the tag and a few wraps of thread to secure it. And I make several wraps with the CDC feather. You can fold the fibers back as you're wrapping it around. And then tie it off. Trim off your tag end. I love how simple this fly is. I just broke the thread. So after you've snipped your thread off, after the thread is broken, and make sure you do break your thread, just simply tie it, tie it in again. Trim off your tag ends. I've got that piece of, other piece of thread here. I'll just snip that off. And you can whip finish it off. I like to put several knots in my fly. Beautiful. This is such a beautiful, simple, classy fly. Little drop of head cement. The fibers are falling back beautifully. Caddis soft hackle.